Today's devotional is found in Proverbs chapter 1 and verse 29. It's called Choosing to Fear God. For they that they hated knowledge and did not choose the fear of the Lord. A reporter saw Jim Taylor, star running back on the Green Bay Packers football team, standing in the team's hotel lobby more than 45 minutes before the bus was scheduled to take the team to the stadium for a playoff game. Why are you here so early, Jim? He asked. I don't want to get left at the hotel, the Hall of Fame running back answered. The Packers were coached by Vince Lombardi, and soon after his arrival in Green Bay, he instituted a schedule that came to be known as Lombardi time. He would announce the start of the practice or the departure time for an event only to begin early, either leaving those who showed up on time behind or critiquing them for being late. The essence of Lombardi time is that if you're not 15 minutes early, you were late. In honor of the famed coach, the clock at Lambeau Field that faces Lombardi Avenue is still set 15 minutes ahead. Lombardi was known as a fierce disciplinarian and his players were expected to comply with his rules without question or argument. Despite his great talent, Jim Taylor was more afraid of disappointing his coach than of almost anything else. Many people in our society today view God casually. This is not just true in the world, but sadly, this attitude has also infected the church. Despite this tide of neglect for the uh, character and nature of God, we must make the choice to swim against the current and maintain our fear of the Lord and recognition of his holiness. When Isaiah saw a glimpse of God's throne in heaven, he said, Woe is me, for I am undone, for mine eyes have seen the King. Isaiah 6.5 Make it your choice to maintain a holy fear of God. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we do pray today that we would not pick up the atmosphere and the feeling of so many in the world to treat you casually. For you are a holy God, our great God, and our God, and loved us so much that you brought us into your family through our Lord Jesus Christ. We pray today that you would help each one of us to choose the fear of God. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Today's word to the wise is choose to fear God and you will be protected from many dangers. Our new verse is found in Romans chapter 12 and verse 2. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind that you may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God.